Hi everyone, happy Tuesday. Hope you're having a great day. I am gonna share a little bit about how long Beauty Counters products last. So this is a question that I often get as people are shopping around looking for different Beauty Counter products. I'm gonna look both ways because I'm on my Facebook in my group and I'm on my phone. Um, but we can look at this question in a couple of different ways. So oftentimes, People say, okay, well, beauty counter products are a little bit more pricey than drugstore products, which is the case, and there are many reasons for that, but we're not going to get into that. But a lot of people will ask, how long do the products last? Like, that's a very common question when you're thinking about uh, a new product that you might be trying. You may be really used to using your current cleanser or your current night cream and you know exactly how long it lasts before it runs out and people have that question oftentimes when they're starting new products. They don't know how long it lasts. So we're gonna look at this from two standpoints. So the first one is the actual shelf life of the product. So that can be very different than how long it lasts because of how long you use it. But first and foremost, I'm gonna share just a little bit about the packaging that Beauty Counter has. And this is actually something that all packaging has, all beauty products. Um, this was something that I just found out when I joined Beauty Counter and I was really excited about it. So whenever you're looking at products, this is our number three balancing charcoal mask, one of our most fit, popular products, um, you can, look at the back or usually the bottom of the product will have a small emblem that will have a little bitty bottle. I will come over here. It's like a little jar with a lid that is tilted up. You can see it right there. Don't mind my fingernails that I need to go get done. And that is how long the product will last once it is opened. So this face mask is nine months. So that means when you open it, you've got about nine months until you should throw it away. Obviously, I'm sure some people keep things for longer than that. It probably won't even last you nine months if you're using it every day, but um, that's just a safety uh, factor for you to check out for the product. So like I said, that's on all of our products. Um, this is the Countermatch uh, Eye Rescue Cream. So you can turn it over and see the bottom is 12 months. So that means that you can, once you open it, you can use it for 12 months total. Um, and again, if you're using these products every day, they may not last for a year. I know for me, my cleansing balm does last for an entire year because I just use it sporadically. Um, the mask actually also use lasts me for a year because I don't use it that much. I probably use it once a week, maybe a little bit more in the summer, just as you know, the weather it's humid and my skin tends to get more congested with using, you know, all sorts of things and it being sweaty and humid. Um, this is our color intense lipstick. And if you look at the bottom, it says 12 months. So just look for that little emblem. Not only are those uh, little markers on Beauty Counter products, but these are my new um, Rawa hair care products that I just got out of the packaging a couple days ago. I love them, by the way. Um, I love the body oil. I've been using it every day. It smells wonderful. And their little emblems are on the back. So this is their body oil. You can see right here, it says 18 months. So from the time that you open it, I mean, that's a long time, 18 months. Um, this one is nine months. This is the hair oil. So you can see, so whenever you're looking around or you're wondering just very basic, like how long does this product last in terms of shelf life, check on the back of the product, on the back or the bottom, depending on what the product is, and it will tell you, that little emblem will say how many months it lasts. So um, I wanted to share those few examples of the Beauty Counter products. The other side of this is how long do they last in terms of what you're using and how much, uh, how long do they last if you're using them every day? Well, obviously the first uh, point to that is how often are you using those products, right? Like I just said, the cleansing balm for me and the charcoal mask, they last a really long time because I don't use them every day. Whereas my nourishing cream exfoliator, I use that every single day and it lasts me about three to four five months, depending on how much I use. You just need a very small amount. Um, I use my charcoal bar every night as well, and that also lasts me a little over three months. So um, I have found that our products tend to last a little bit longer than the traditional drugstore product just because of the quality of ingredients that are in the product itself. So um, a lot of times when you're buying things right off the shelf, um, they're not the highest quality ingredients. They contain a lot of water, a really high percentage of water in the product itself, and that means that you have to use more of the product to get the result that you want, or you may not even be getting a result. You may just have to use a lot of the product. And Beauty Counter 
really um, uses very high quality product. They source from the best places possible. And so I truly believe that the products do last a long time. Whereas maybe if you're uh, buying a over-the-counter cleanser, like a Neutrogena or a Cetaphil, where you may be replacing it every one or two months, you may double that with a beauty counter cleanser just due to the ingredients itself. And the fact that there are no um, PEGs in it, There, if you look at the ingredients, there, there may be water in the ingredients ingredient, but um, it's typically not as large of a percentage as maybe some of the other products. So um, those are just two of the things that I wanted to cover um, in terms of packaging and how long things last. It's one of, like I said, one of the most common questions that I get. So whenever you're looking for products, just ask the person that you're talking to and they'll be able to guide you to how often you should use the product, how much you should use. What I have found is you need a very little amount. I mean, you've seen me post about the counter match eye cream. It is the tiniest little pebble of um, eye cream. You don't need very much at all. And same with many of the other products. So uh, let me know if you have any questions about product shelf life, how long the products last. I'd be more than happy to give you more information on that as you need. So have a good Tuesday and I'll talk to you all soon. Bye.